The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the women's prestigious championship. Jimmy, it is now time for the Pride Championship. While we still away for Jay Guy, will he make it? Will he not? We won't know until the main event. But before the main event, we have the Pride Championship is on the line. And I say with the OCW Universe Galaxy and everybody in between the Milky Way for OCW Universe, Jimmy, thank goodness we're about to have a Pride Championship title opportunity for the female she versus the champion suplex. There she is, Jimmy. Thank, thank goodness is right. Here comes the Pride Champion, the woman who says it's Pride Champion nice. Month every month. That would be Suplex. Suplex, it's now what? I believe the official calendar says 100 days as Pride Champion with now the first defense. That's not to begrudge Hifumi or Suplex. That's just stating fact. But finally, one of the most anticipated championship matches that I can think of in the in, in our uh, history, at least in the modern era, or at least in this season's era, if you want to break it down to the minutia. We got a Fumi, we got Suplex finally in the ring, one-on-one -on -one for the Pride Championship. I know all the ladies in the back are looking. I know, I know Junko Gerardus is looking. I know Bell is looking. I know Ashley Moores is looking. I know Flojo's looking. I know freaking Mega Suzuki is looking, probably. I know Ra Rachel's not looking. I know Marissa's looking. Pearl, maybe. Is it fool me? The crowd's not happy with Suplex right now. Sue does not look ready to nope. give up that championship, Jay. Got a vice-like grip on that championship. Could it be for the last time in her first defense? Throw it up. Yes, it is. It's been thrown up, Jim. Let's go. We got it for me. We got Suplex. These two just plain look like they don't like each and other. And we have Jay. Greg. There Here's Greg. Go. He's yeah, starting he, it. You see that? You see the hand? He's all oh, trying to blow kisses and get slapped. What do you think this is? This is not Japan. You find the kaiju. Who, who that? Jesus. I'll tell you what. I think that uh, Hifumi is not ready for the championship level of this match. It being her first championship match, obviously taunting your opponent to start the match was not a smart move. It's a rookie mistake, and she got clapped for it for being, for being a rookie. It's a good point you made, Jimmy. But another point that I'm going to make, oh, Jesus Christ. I don't know if that was a Faye Moose, sir, but that was a Faye Me, sir, on the Fumi oh. opening contest as as uh, Greg looks on. But Junko Jirota will be taking on uh, the champion. Matter of fact, that's uh, what you call it. What's, what's the word called? This just in breaking news, Jimmy. Breaking news, cause I said oh, breaking so. news. We gotta, we gotta build, so. we gotta, we gotta build this, this prestigious pride back. So that being said, in the guest booker matchup by one COO Drago Caesar next week for Turbo 320, not 420, 320. We'll have Junko Jirota not taking on Fumi, but taking on the winner of this match for the Pride Championship. So she could be taking on Hifumi and Mayoshi, or she be taking on Suplex. We won't know. Whoever the wow. champ is, she gonna take, yeah. It may be this our maybe the turn around. Who knows what I'm saying right now? Maybe things turn sideways. I don't know, Jim, it's crazy. It's chaotic right now. We're Break, waiting for people to show Breaking up, news. You are blowing my mind right now, Jay. I'm breaking news too. about Junko oh. and this championship being defended again. You Again. gotta get the prestige back, Jim. Or at least try oh. to. I don't know what's gonna happen. We're gonna find out who somebody. You gonna, oh. You're gonna make it a workhorse championship. That's what you're Hell gonna Hell yeah. Boss. Workhorse championship, but now nah, we'll see. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that maybe next people has something different. I don't know. I'm just here for the ride sometimes, Jim. Slap. Oh, and followed by modified, Jim. That's a modified pepper. Modified Pepperton. Pepper there it is. Modified Pepperton. Is Joe breaking the boot? 
Jesus. Oh, that, that <laughs> just bush has some straight up. Uh, that's the, that's the raw power of the quick. Nebraska corn uh, fed Sue suplex. Sue looks like she pushed her out of her boots there. Yeah, it's a, that's why she's the, the kaiju. You see that on the back. You see Gogeta on the back for that. This is where it started from. Kept calling her Gogeta and they became personal. They were, they were uh, friends and potential tag team, but that went south many, many moons ago, Jim. As it normally does in relationships in professional oh, wrestling. No, the oh, outside the ring now. Yeah, uh, into it. the extremely thick padding that has been reinforced this year. You know. You know exactly right. Fantastic. For the new year, new padding. Plus, you can sleep on it if you wanted to. I wouldn't recommend it because there's always sweat and blood in between the cracks, but I digress. I, I will tell you, before the match, Champions I actually advantage. did lay down and feel, and, and it's pretty pretty comfortable. Oh, what a nasty kick to the face off of that, that uh, <laughs> battle roll there. Yeah, that wasn't comfortable, but but Hifumi breaking the count. This is just getting ugly. Sue is just raining down advantage. punches on that Hifumi. That means she doesn't have to. She can she can lose by by disqualification and still become still remain the pride champion. So Hifumi has to keep it in the ring and apply pressure. But right now Hifumi's having a big big trouble, big tough time keeping Sue in the ring. Then that's why power, Jim, pure power on this play. Uh, Sue is one step ahead of Hifumi in all points in this match right now indeed and Good observation hifumi you can't win the match outside the ring can't oh but the drop kick we got a six count we got to get these women in the ring sue's gonna once again you see sue taking a sweet time sauntering if you will we got an eight count oh she's gonna i, don't, I, I was gonna say i don't think sue's above winning this match by count out it, it, correct the mundo like i said like i said a few moments ago, she a hey, champion's advantage. Quick night to the pay window, Jim. Uh, those are the best nights. That's we yeah, call it a Friday night nasty. Oh! We saw earlier. It's been a it's been a rocket show, man. At Ashley and Flo. These two are counting back and forth. Everything. We're, we're we're starting to we're starting to almost get to hell for leather here. <laughs> hell for leather territory, you think, Jim? Oh, absolutely. As if we have another dodge. Uh, Hufumi finally lands a shot, but more counters and <laughs> Solba kick. So, so much going counts. on in this match right yeah, now. Yeah, goddamn right, Jim. Greg watching on. Another, another kick takes down Sue. This could be the opportunity that Hifumi needs to even up the score. It's still dangerous ground, like Maurice's, Mark Reese's theme song. Oh, boy. Looks like Sue is down. Oh, what, a, me. what an innovative piece of offense. I like that innovative piece of offense. That is vintage, even though she's still a rookie here, Fumi. A lot, of, a lot of not much wasted moment or rather motion with her offense, Jim. Yeah, it's very efficient, and she's very aerodynamic oh. as she hits the Huracrana off the spring. Thing of beauty. These two women look like we're starting to get into the deep waters here, Jay, and they're starting to get a little bit tired. The match is starting to slow down a little bit, and I think that favors suplex because of maneuvers like that. That's like a modified full stop. That's like a half tilt, if you will. Down goes the Fumi suplex. That's a full still. tilt. Yeah, full <laughs> tilt, baby. The, the cousin of full stop, if you will. And once again, more power. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, oh what a... <laughs> Caved Hifumi's chest in, but she still kicks out at one. Lots of fight in Hifumi Mayoshi tonight. Oh, you hear that? This is wrestling. Women's wrestling, too. Sue's feeling herself. Sue's been reading the, the social media, calling her a paper champion, not the Oh, she was going for the Mission Usco driver. No. Right, no what's your that no one? Sue, but nice cradle rock neck breaker by Hifumi with the with the pin combination some people pay for that nasty work kick out by sue it's getting deep one it's getting now deep jimmy this is where tapu oh, says the real match begins joe breaker it, well we're gonna see which one of these women swims better in those deep waters oh, i love that once again sue powering up on the on the inside if fumi's in a bit of trouble into the corner she goes counter big elbow Oh, that one looks Kick. like it might have knocked the tooth out. <laughs> but it didn't connect. It now oh, she rolls her up. Oh, Greg saw the rope break. Unlike at Summerside, he saw the rope break tonight. Oh. <laughs> 
Good eye, Jim. Good eye. Here we go. Oh, God damn. A backdrop into a, <laughs> a Butt soccer kick, kick, to the I would spine. call that. Yeah, a soccer kick to the spine. It looks like Sue's calling for the end for Hifumi. Counter by Hifumi, who still has fight left in with Another her Oh, my God. Link it up, match it up, Jim. We synced in stereo with the Hermakonradas. Jesus Christ. Oh, Hifumi's picking up the pace, boss. This is not good for Sue. Another Hurricanrana. Hurricanrana top she of the key. She is pulling out all you the stops to try and take this Pride element. Championship away. Is it time for a moonsault? Oh! We got ourselves a 20 FPS moonsault on the island. Oh, we might not have ourselves a new... Oh, oh Greg saw. And what a... What <laughs> ring presence by Sue. My... I can tell you what. Oh, Jesus Christ. Boss, I might have had a little bit too much to drink earlier. My, my vision's starting to get a little blurry. No, yeah, see, I'm seeing ghosts myself. <laughs> Jim, not sure what the hell's happening. Once again, top of the key. Ghost, he fooled me, bro. As they say, slow motion for me. Oh! Oh, Hafumi Each... misses this oh, time, that's though. that's unfortunate. Sue's just going to go ahead and try and cover her off the flat. miss. Oh, that is really unfortunate of a hoop. Looks like Suplex she planted. Suplex is going to walk out the winner tonight and retain her pride championship, Jay, who she's apparently going to defend against Junko Jirota on Terminal 320 per the boss sitting right next to me. Never trust what I say, Jim. Sometimes I'm wrong. Sometimes I'm right. Sometimes I just make things up as I go along. But right now, Suplex has retained successfully. The Pride Championship against the Fumi Miyoshi in a spirited competition. What's next? Oh, shit. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, shit. <laughs> Dragana Caesar? What is she doing out here? I don't know, Jim, but the, the waters and the temperature have just changed. Dramatically. Yeah, it looks like Suplex has given her the ring, uh, which is probably a smart thing to do. If you're Sue, you just got done with a grueling championship match, so you don't want any of this. That's very well said, Jim. Suplex does not look happy, boss. Tyler Knott, next week, Junko Suplex Pride Championship, and Dragana's waiting in the wings. It's getting more interesting for the Pride Division, Jim, and we will see you very much shortly as we continue on to the break of dawn.